Hi, my name is Ashton Plinik, and join me today as I talk about my troop. First, I'm going to be talking about the variety of campouts that me and my troop go on. Our most recent campout was at King's Landing. After we were done teaching the Cub Scout Scout skills, we got to go swim in this beautiful area and play fish and canoe. We even flipped five minutes into our canoe trip. But sadly, I did not get that on camera. Another recent campout that we just went on was the family campout all the way in Daytona Beach. Here in this video, I tried hugging my friend that doesn't like being touched. Of course, he didn't like that. Here's an image from another campout we just went on where we learned how to kayak, canoe, and water safety. It was a really fun campout. Another big thing we do at Scouts is summer camps. Every summer, we go to a different summer camp, one in Florida and then one out of state. This year, we went to North Carolina. First, we take a very long bus ride to get to the summer camp. But we just sleep and watch movies and keep each other entertained past the boredom. Once we arrived, we set up camp at this beautiful area with these small little cabins we stayed in. Once we were done eating dinner and setting up, we went to campfire where the staff tried entertaining us. And it could be a little cringe and strange sometimes. The next day, we went to our classes. And my first class was horsemanship. And we, all, we got to hold farm animals and learn everything about horses. Here's my friend holding a chicken. After we're done with the classes and eating lunch, we hang out. This is my friend Kyle. He's loud, but really funny. Um, that's my brother Gavin right there. Uh, and then there's my friend Aniel. He's funny. And then my friend Ashton. We have the same name. It's kind of cool, but it can be confusing at times. Now, why we take the classes for summer camp is because it gets us merit badges. Once we learn and demonstrate that we know that skill, we get the merit badge. Merit badges is one of the very many things you need to do to rank up with scouts. Going easy from hardest, scouter being the easiest, ingle being the hardest. Once a month, we hold a thing called a court of honor. At a court of honor, we receive our ranks and merit badges that we worked on and earned during that month. Here's a picture of me receiving my life rank from my scoutmaster. Life rank is the rank right before eagle. Here's another picture of me when I'm, I was MC at the Court of Honor. MC is when you make all the announcements during the Court of Honor, and it's part of getting your life rank. Our troop also d does a lot of things for our community. Here in this video, we're doing a food drive for a homeless shelter. It was took a long time and it was a lot of hard work, but it was definitely worth it in the long run. So another thing we do in Scouts is we collect all the American flags that are retired, which is a worn out and unusable American flag, and we unfurl them, rip them up into pieces that in the proper way, and then we burn it in the fire pit. The fire pit has to be really hot because we need to burn multiple flags, and we do it to 30 to 75 second order. And it's a process to which honor our fallen soldiers. Now I'm going to be talking about some of the history of scouts. Here's an image of Lord Baden Powell. Lord Baden Powell was out in the wilderness a lot, and when he got back from the army, he discovered that he became a national hero. He also found out that his small handbook that he had written for soldiers, Aids to Scouting, was being used by youth leaders and teachers all over the country to teach observation and woodcraft. His newfound fame led to him led to invitations to speak at meetings and rallies all across Britain. And while I was at while at Boys Brigade gathering the group, they asked him to improve citizenship training for boys. Baden Powell immediately set to work in rework aids to scouting for a younger audience. And in 1907, he had an experiment where they went to a camp at Brown Sea Island off the coast of Dorset. So Baden Powell organized 22 boys to go on the trip. And after the, a great success, it started the scout movement. Thank you for watching my video and please enjoy this compilation I made of me and my troop having fun through the year.